Hi friends. Hi friends. <laughs> Yay. Love seeing people show up. Hi. Little wave. Hi. So we are going to start Yoga Nidra in just a few minutes here. For those of you who are new to Nidra, just let yourself fill into this practice. We will get started here in just a moment, waiting for just another moment for people to come on in, feel into a little relaxation. And if you're coming into this space and you want to just give yourself a moment, hi, oh my gosh, do I just keep, I can't help myself, I have to keep hitting the waves. So if you're coming into this space and we're waiting for a few more people to join, maybe just setting your hand on your heart and your belly, taking a deep breath in and out, finding ourselves in the space of Nidra place, right? So Nidra is a very healing and relaxing body scan. I like to call it the scan. Hi there. Yes, asthma. Woo, woo, woo. Okay, I'm toning it down a bit. So we're going to start this Nidra practice. But as we're starting, you can sit upright if you'd like to, or you can find a really relaxing and restorative Shavasana pose or some type of restorative pose that feels good to you and whatever you choose, you're not stuck. If you end up wanting to lay down after seating or come and rise after laying down, entirely up to you. Hi friends. Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and um, we, let's wait one more minute as we're getting set up. So if you have props, something like to put under your knees if you're laying back, something to support your head, Maybe if you want to have a magic crystal around, I need some grounding energy a lot of the times. Um, and maybe, maybe if you're up, sitting upright, you get a meditation pillow. I know I've got all the goods going on here. So, okay, let's get this Nidra party started. So, just settling into your place. If you wanna start with your hands on your heart and your belly, whether you're sitting up or laying back, and just kind of scanning the body, closing our eyes and scanning the body for any areas of tension. And if we can't, if we don't recognize those areas, I'm just gonna guide you for a moment through parts of the body that we can soften a little deeper so we can really get the benefits of this Nidra. So starting with your head, whether it's laying on the ground or you're sitting up, imagining the head and the mind just softening a little, your jaw softening and your tongue softening, feeling yourself ease into peace with your neck, maybe your shoulders soften down your back, you can sense them releasing tension, and then moving into the torso and the hip space and feel the hips kind of unravel and release and soften there. And then moving into the fingers and toes and just letting them loosen their grip. And then we will go ahead and start the Nidra. So we're gonna scan the body part by part, bringing our awareness to each individual section of the body. And we're gonna start with the right hand thumb, drawing all our attention and awareness to the right hand thumb, the first finger, the middle finger, the ring finger, and the pinky finger. Bring all the healing energy and awareness to all of the fingers, the soft part of the hand, the top of the right hand, the right wrist, the right forearm, the right elbow, the right bicep, the right shoulder, all of your energy and awareness 
through the entirety of the right arm. Your right arm is at ease and completely relaxed. The right arm is completely relaxed. So we're gonna move into the left hand thumb, the first finger, the middle finger, the ring finger, and the pinky finger, drawing all your energy and healing awareness into all of the fingers, the palm of the left hand, the top of the left hand, the left wrist, the left forearm, the left elbow, the left bicep, the left shoulder, the entirety of the left arm is at peace and completely relaxed. Both the right and left arm are at ease and completely relaxed. Start moving your energy and awareness to your chest, into your abdomen, around the lower back, the middle back, and the upper back, feeling the whole of the torso move into a space of ease, feeling that ease wind down the spine from the atlas all the way to the tailbone, feeling that healing energy move through the spine, feeling space, feeling ease, feeling light, your entire torso and spine are at ease and completely relaxed. Moving into the space of the hips, the hip bones, the glutes, the pelvis, feeling all of the energy move into that space, untangle and unravel any tension that resides there feeling yourself soften and melt with ease into that place and space. The entirety of the hips are at ease and completely relaxed, melting a little bit further, drawing all your energy and awareness to the right thigh, the right knee, the right shin, the right calf, swirling around the right ankle, the top of the right foot, the bottom of the right foot, the big toe, first toe, second toe, third toe, and fourth toe. Feeling ease wash down your entire right leg and out your toes. The entire right leg, foot and toes are at ease and completely relaxed, finding even more ease in the entirety of the right leg. Drawing our energy and awareness into the left thigh, the left knee, left calf, left shin, swirling around the left ankle, the top of the left foot, the bottom of the left foot, the left big toe, first toe, second toe, third toe, and fourth toe. Feel the entirety of your left leg, knee, foot, and toes fall into ease and become completely relaxed. The entirety of your left leg is at ease and completely relaxed. Bringing that space up into the head, the neck, the jaw, the tongue, the teeth, your nose, your cheeks, 
your eyes, your eyelids, your eyelashes, your eyebrows, your forehead, your hair, the hair follicles, your ears, the entirety of your scalp is at ease and completely relaxed. And that ease moves into your mind, melting away tension. Anything that has had a grip on you starts to ease and unravel, melting off your body. Your flesh starts melting off the bone. The muscles start to release any tension and fall away. The tendons and ligaments fall into ease. The bones fall away. You come into your spirit body and feel the essence of your being, feeling light, feeling at peace, feeling at ease washed into this beautiful space, beautiful spot, falling deeper and deeper into this softness, this effortlessness. The grip is loosening, tension unraveling, your body melting feeling your space of ease further and further. We're gonna move through the chakra center from the root, feeling soft and grounded here, the root center, moving into the sacral center, feeling joy and effortlessness, right below the belly button through that whole lower abdomen feeling warm, soft, and sensual, moving above the belly button into the solar plexus, feeling light radiate through your body and it's warm, it's free, it's light. It feels so beautiful like the sunshine radiating through you feeling that beautiful energy move into your heart chakra. And with each pulse of your body, you feel yourself deepening into the space of love for yourself, for others, for your life, for your body, for this gift that was given to you. Feeling that space move into the throat chakra. Feeling yourself speak words of loving kindness to yourself, to others. Your truth is love and you melt with those words. I love you. I love myself. Melting further into that ease and that space. Moving into the third eye, your knowing is that space of ease, more love, the light of you, and feeling that beautiful peace move into the crown, up and out the body, into your bliss body, into that space. Feel that space and place wash over you the light that's coming out of your crown lands back onto your body and you can feel yourself melt a little bit further. So with each breath, when you breathe in, breathe in peace and you breathe out ease. And we will do another light scan on the body to check back in feeling your head resting on the ground or feeling a little lighter if you're sitting up, feeling that light energy move down your neck like warm water and liquid, feeling that sensation fall down your shoulders as they release tension, 
moving into more ease. Everything is falling away that felt heavy. Your arms start to loosen and lighten. Your hands start to open and loosen their grip further. Feeling the washing of ease move through your torso. Your abdomen is not tense, it just lets go. Your hips let go even further. Feeling the softness of you, the softness of your precious body. Feeling your legs feel so content to just be here in this sacred space of calm. Feeling that healing washing through your body, moving through the entirety of your legs into your feet starting to feel the washing from the crown that moves like a flood through the crown to the arms and out the fingers. Feeling that washing again from the crown all the way down your arms and out your fingers. And then feel that flooding healing light move from your crown and all the way out your toes. Again, the washing of healing from your crown all the way out your toes. And then moving your hands to your heart and your belly, finding the flesh that is you, loving and honoring the space that is you. Taking a deep breath in to this place and letting go. A couple more deep breaths into your body and letting go and again and as we're resting here before we even think about rising taking some time to feel that ease and sensation giving our body the recognition and ourselves the recognition of this calm place, maybe how we felt before, how we feel now, our cells have changed, and with each time we come to this place, our body recognizes it further, very healing space for us, taking things down a notch, coming back to the essence of us, the simplicity, the breath, the heart beating, the intricate, beautiful system of our body, the energy centers. Take a deep breath into your body and out. And wherever you are right now, maybe you want to hug your knees into your body Take a moment for your body to be restful and really absorb this practice. If it feels good to you, maybe you bend your knees and take your feet wide and just sway your knees side to side with a little ease. And maybe it reminds you to bring some more ease into your life through your thoughts, through your words, through your actions taking a little more time to wind down, finding that place. If it feels good to you, maybe again, taking your hand to your heart and your belly, just checking in. I am so grateful for you guys honoring this space and time that you took for you and the energy that you create from doing this practice and how it seeps out uh, and reaches others. We could all use a little more calm in our life. So I am grateful again to you for practicing with me tonight. Namaste today and every single day. And I will stay on here for a few more minutes if anyone has any questions or any comments. Cool. Yes, if 
you're new to Yoga Nidra, it is super healing. And, oh, you're so welcome. You're so welcome. Yes, that you're so welcome. I love the thank yous. You're, oh, yay, Jenna. Cool, cool. Yeah, oh, I love it. Stay safe and positive, everyone. Yes, stay safe and positive. I love it. Thank you, namaste, goddess. Oh, very sweet, you guys. I'm gonna be doing this more often on my own page, um, Azure Wolf, and I love you guys for gifting yourself that to your body. It's very important to me. I've been a diabetic for 40 years and have really noticed what Yoga Nidra has done for me, so I know it can do something beautiful for everyone in the entire world. Um, I wish you nothing but love, light, and laughter as these things are going on right now, finding that space of joy, calm, reflection, whatever it is. I hope you guys join me next time. Oh, thank you so, oh, you guys are so sweet. Thank you so much, ladies. Thank you so much for having me on here. Have an awesome night. I'm getting ready to teach yoga at 6.30. So sending you love and um, we will see you next time.